Zion. We move. My name is Dr. Daniel. Um, I'm the MD and CEO of CDN Oil and Lubricants. Um, I started off my business some years ago, and um, the business took a completely uh, nosedive to the point that uh, we couldn't even find anything to take care of ourselves. However, on the 2nd of March 2023, my mom, who happens to be a very strong follower of Zion, has been trying to get me to listen to the divine mercy and open heavens. Uh, but I was a little bit stubborn about it. But then on the 2nd of March, she called my attention that it feels like there is a, a prophecy that goes in line with your situation. Uh, and then um, I, I tuned in and I listened and I claimed it. Um, again, the same day in the open heavens, there was another prophecy again about me, which actually has my name on it. There is a man, he is part of this commission. You are into all year business, petroleum, all year. Problem from the east, west, north, and south visited you. The doors of your business, petroleum business, was closed. You yeah, are my brother for a long time. You don't know what is happening to you. I see a new season in your life. Amen. This is a new season that is coming now. Amen. From what I see, you are into petroleum. You are into business of oil. You will come and give testimony. Amen. Because a new season has opened. Amen. A new chapter has been opened. Amen. Your yoke is broken. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. In the Holy Ghost. Amen. 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 The Holy Ghost. Amen. Another video again on the night of open heavens. Where he actually, um, uh, brother Ibuka actually mentioned my name. For a long time. For a long time. I see you receiving it. Chukuka Iga Wegwo. Makonya Nemi Kemje and this person called Chukuka, I don't know if it's the debt they are owing you. I don't know if it's the money they are owing you. But I see you receiving money. And it's a big one. And I see you celebrating. Amen. Chukuka, get ready. It will come in millions. Amen. Your yoke is broken. Amen. Go and begin to celebrate. Amen. If it comes here, it's already settled. Amen. So far, it's already prophesied. It's already settled. Amen. And the Bible says, the word that go out of my mouth shall not return to me void. And say it accomplish why he said it. Your case is settled. Amen. In the name of J-E-S-U-S. So in less than 48 hours after the night of open heavens, my staff called me and said, said there is a senator that wants to have a meeting with me. And he had already made a deposit into the company's account. So I got to the office the Monday of uh, that call, and we had a distribution deal worth over 400 million. It hasn't, it hasn't stopped. It hasn't finished. It hasn't finished. So I flew, I flew into Lagos the next day, and luckily for me, I was able to meet uh, uh, my our daddy in the Lord. He prayed with me and, um, uh, and asked me to come give a testimony, which I wasn't very comfortable with at that point in time because I'm a very private person. Um, but uh, something ha happened when I came for this 100 days program. I was supposed to be here on Sunday. I got a call again to come into the office that I was supposed to have a meeting with another, uh, the former, a former governor of the state. Um, uh, I, because of that, didn't come on Sunday. So I delayed my coming. But one thing struck me here is that it's very important to take God very seriously. And then don't put your hope in man. Because I didn't come on that Sunday and came to Zion Ministry on Wednesday. By Wednesday, when I stepped my foot here, I had already started praying. Yesterday, when they were having the program, and uh, brother, um, um, our daddy was asking everybody to, to uh, hold their hands where they wanted healing. Hey, this sounds very funny, but I actually held my hands in my pocket <laughs> because that was where I wanted healing from. And um, my phone was on the ground. Before that prayer was ended, I saw a missed call on my phone. By the time I got back to my hotel room, I called and it was a member of the House of Reps 
telling me that a deal for over a billion naira that we have been pushing for was already billion. Are you still sitting down there, Megan? Our testimonies here are verifiable. What's this your is script? our brother stealing a deal of one billion naira. Give to the people a hot pack. Who wants to claim this money? Who wants? Who wants? Celebrate Jesus, celebrate Jesus, celebrate Jesus, celebrate Jesus, celebrate Jesus, celebrate Jesus, celebrate Jesus. everywhere, run around everywhere here, yeah. run around everywhere, run around, run around everywhere, run around everywhere. I said run around. You are like a bird in the cage. Who wants to be a billionaire? The first one, about 400 million. He was here. Another contract of one billion. Listen, oh, I told you people. Now, kiss banana. What you have not experienced before in your family, you will begin to experience it. <laughs> 